mystery and stuff. After a tiring day, the best way to relax is by recharging through a good night's sleep. And when you're a mom with little kids, the exhaustion of babysitting the tiny tornadoes is no joke, which means that every minute of a restful slumber is definitely important. However, it was not just like any night for Randy Jo Ampt. She and her family had to leave their house and stay in a hotel room that night because of the flood. They were in a lot of stress, and her kids are trying to sleep after a grueling day. She was also ready to hit the sack until she heard the loud noises from down the hall. Other people would have rushed to the other room and yelled at the loud guests. But Randy Jo decided to do things differently. She explained on her Facebook post, I was frustrated but wanted to wait to talk to them when I could tell them about our situation to see if they could show compassion rather than become angry at the lady next door. She wanted to talk it out with the other guests, but she missed them the next morning. As it turned out, the occupants in the other room were teenagers and they're members of the Future Farmers of America. They traveled from Kansas to Indiana to attend a convention. Randy Joe did not get an opportunity to have a chat with the teens until Friday night when she noticed that their room door was slightly ajar. She decided to finally let them know about the situation. I let them know about our house being destroyed by water. I told them that we wanted them to have their fun and we would appreciate their respect to let our kids get good rest. The young man who answered the door told me that he was very sorry about what we were going through. All was well, and the teens seemed to have dialed the noise down. What happened next was something that Randy Joe least expected. Before I went to bed, I noticed a note that someone had slipped under our door. I opened the note to find money, the mom shared further on her Facebook post. Inside their note of apology, the teenagers from Kansas tucked $40, and their message was short but kind. We are more than sorry for waking you and your family up the past few nights. We hope everything goes well with your house. The Amps were touched by the FFA member's thoughtful act. Her post about the moving encounter went viral, and she capped it off sweetly. In a world where some people sit behind screens and become angry on social media, this young man restored my faith that the next generation can make eye contact and show compassion to the person right in front of him. They set an excellent example for my children and their parents should be more than proud. The post was shared for about 10,000 times and reactions were just as many. The FFA members were blown away by the online reception to their simple but inspiring deed. In an interview, one of the teens named Tanner Wells shared, I just thought we could do something for them that I think could change their day, brighten up their day a little bit. Randy Joe and her family were thankful for the gift given by the teens. As a way of showing their gratitude, the family decided to pay it forward by helping the homeless using the money from the FFA members. Truly, one act of kindness never ends if it is appreciated and paid forward. What an inspiring story.